So let's go with an example here. So group one, five members data, we have 10, 6, 16, 17, and 13. And group two also we have five members, 7, 13, 22, 15, and 12. Now we want to find out the difference between these two groups by using manually new test. In order to use manually new test, we have to convert this data into a rank. So let's have the ranks here. This is rank one, rank two. So let's start rank from the lowest one. Combining all these 10 data, we'll start to rank from lowest one. The lowest one is six here, so it will become one first rank. And seven will be second. Then 10 will be third. 12 will be fourth. And if you see 13, we have two people are there. So what will we do in this case? So we'll add fifth rank and sixth rank and we'll divide it by two. That is five plus six by two. That is 11 by 2, it will be 5.5 here also, and here also 5.5. So, 6th rank is added here, next we will have the 7th rank, that is 15, and then 8th is 16, 9th is 17, and 22 is 10th rank. Now we have to find out the sum of ranks in group 1. So, group 1 sum of rank is 26.5. So, R1 is 26.5. Next, we'll find out mu1 with this formula n1 multiplied by n1 plus n2 plus 1 by 2. So it is 5 multiplied by 5 plus 5 plus 1 by 2. So we'll get mu as 27.5. Next, we'll find out sd with this formula n1 into n2 multiplied by n1 plus n2 plus 1 divided by 12. So again 5 into 5, 5 plus 5 plus 1 by 12, square root, we we'll get the SD of 4.787. Then use it in the Z formula. Z R1 minus mu1 divided by SD, 26.5 minus 27.5 divided by 4.787. We will get Z score of 0 0.208. Since the Z value is less than 1.96, we have to accept the null hypothesis. Stating that there is no difference between these two groups.